Hello, my name is Pure Hanma. Goki Buridash couldn't make it to this video because I think Jack bit his mic and chewed on it, so it just stopped working. Anyway, speaking of biting and chewing, we're gonna talk about in this video why Pickle and Jack had their bite off. I don't think anyone has heard of this term before, bite off, but it's whatever. The term doesn't really matter, just what matters is why they do it. I know Jack explained that his bite strength is enough to rip out parts of a coconut before their clash, but I don't think that part alone can give a reasonable enough background to justify the bite off. So let me explain. You see, in the Maximum Tournament, an old part of Baki's anime that Netflix didn't produce, for some reason, let's hope we get a remastered version of that. Jack would use biting as a way of fighting to help him win matches. In episode 40, Jack would face Alexander Gallen, the same person who would fight Soskorsky at the start of New Grappler Baki and lose, where Jack would bite Gallen's hand with enough force that he manages to rip out two of his fingers two of Mother Russia's fingers. In the finals of the Maximum Tournament, Baki would face Baki in a match where Jack would bite Baki's branchial artery. Yeah, the that, that place, you know? And this injury would have almost killed Baki if he didn't defeat Jack in just enough time to win the match and properly stop the bleeding. And these moments are just two of the many times where Jack would use biting in the Maximum Tournament. If it was a situation where his opponent would somehow manage to evade his brute force or he will need to escape from a submission, biting is the way to go. So that's the major reason why Jack decided to have a bite off with Pickle. And uh, it's not because Jack likes to swing both ways, if you know what I mean. With this scene, it might have given you the impression like that, but it's just because Jack uses biting to damage his opponents. And trying to bite someone who uses the same weapon as him, it might not sound that weird after all. The reason that like, he didn't try to bite Soskorsky and Ali Jr. in the past is because he didn't think that much of them. Jack didn't take any steroids before fighting Ali Jr. too. I'm not sure about Soskorsky, but I think he didn't take any in their fight as well. Because we didn't see any mention of them or Jack's muscles twitching from the drug use. Anyway, this is pretty much it. Jack has a whole history of biting behind him. I thought it would be better to explain this since a lot of people don't watch or don't know about the Maximum Tournament. Thank you guys for watching. Comment down below what you think about this video and who you like more, either Jack or Pickle. Subscribe if you enjoyed the video and have a nice day.